Hello everybody, it's JJM Jim. Welcome back to Prison Architect and the Brick by Brick Correctional Facility. We are doing a couple things. I opened up bureaucracy. I want to get remote access going so we can get doors that are opening up by themselves so we don't need guards constantly opening doors. And then I also started researching tax relief. It costs us 10 grand, but I think it's going to be a good thing in the long run. And uh, we do have a little bit of money to do it. I also would love to do... Uh, start getting death row going you should also probably get guard to towers and tasers and definitely need to get tasers especially once we get more medium and maximum security and super max and death row and all those things but yeah i was thinking for the door access stuff we may be able to sneak that in right here like if we put a wall yeah i don't know we'll see Maybe we put a wall right here. We can have just a small room where guards can come and do do that sort of thing. But we'll see. So I also cleared this out and uh, took away the solitary cell. We might I might end up putting it back. But because we are going to need solitary cells for these guys. However, I want to give them visitation. Because they're going to need that. Uh, they're going to need visitation at some point. Especially when there's going to be more of them. Because we are going to get more snitches. Especially once we start getting more medium security guys. We are going to get more snitches. So I want to make a visitation room. Does that have to be a certain size? I always forget. Where is visitation? Does not need to be a certain size. So I'm thinking we do something like um like that. I guess. Uh Maybe one down, and then let's put the brick walls back. We're essentially just reshaping this a bit. Uh, let's just put a staff door in here. <clears throat> and then we'll just put a couple visitor tables. Um, two of them in there. There we go. Plenty of visitation for these guys. And then I think what we'll just end up doing is... Uh, making this a solitary cell at the end here. And I think that'll be just fine. Put a toilet in here. And a, uh... Ah, hell, we might as well put a bed in here. We do have a bed available, so let's just do it. We'll put a bed, uh, like that. And this will be solitary for our, uh, these guys here. Sweet. Excellent. Let's just make sure the deployment. Uh, this is. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, nope. This is protected only, and so is the solitary cell. And so are these dormitories. Oh, shit. Yeah, that would have been bad. I'm really glad I checked on that. That would have been good to know. So, there you go. Shouldn't have the solitary guys going anywhere else in the prison the nice thing is they are separated enough by several doors so that if they are like getting up and doing some stuff in here they're not going to actually have it who the hell is that who's got a drill the fuck guys oh someone just picked that up was it richard white search this guy and search williams too and let's just search chisholm search these guys i think they may have one of them may have picked up the drill we gotta pick that stuff up as soon as we confiscate it. I don't understand that. Is it Williams? No, Williams is clean. What about White? Someone search White. Skilled fighter. We need to get some more, like, um, intelligence. Do we even have any of that stuff? Not really. Another. F yeah, okay. Who had the drill? Ah, shit. I don't know who had that drill. Well, I'm not real sure what happens to you, but I think... What is it? Policy? Uh, let's see. Mm, I guess we only have... Oh, no. Here we go. Found tools. Oh, shit. I forgot to, like, do all of this. If you, have, if you find weapons on them, they have to go to solitary for 10 hours. No, it should be 12 hours. And we have to search them. Found tools... Um, yeah, I mean, we got to search them, and they're also got to go to solitary for, uh, 10 hours. 
Drugs, solitary for, I don't know, let's just do six hours for drugs, that's fine. And we should probably search them as well. Luxuries, uh, I guess lockdown for three hours. And uh, we'll search them as well. Yeah, all right. Not messing around in here. So we have 18 grand, shower time, the heat is relatively low, and that is good. Wait, what the hell is this? Who's this guy? Felix Redman. Wait a minute. What the hell? You're not protective custody. What are you doing in here? Are we out of solitary cells? Oh, man. We may need more solitary cells. See, why do these guys all hang out in here? I don't understand this. But I don't like it at all. Uh, damn. I wonder if we need more solitary cells for these guys. It's definitely possible. I don't really know where we put them, though. I guess we could, uh, take this yard back. Just dismantle everything in this yard. Mm. Oh, shit, a bunch of guys just got out. We just got an extra nine grand. What the what? Well, that is awesome. Uh, let's get, uh, these, this, uh, hooked up here to the main thing. Uh... Yeah, I don't know what to do about that. Maybe this is the best way. I mean, not many people are using this yard anyway. So, I guess I could move the kennels and stuff. Do we even need to move the kennels? This could be a hallway. Let's plan this out. Let's just plan it out. So, if we do a two-way hallway, um, I guess we could just make this a hallway. And then if we just go up, how big are these? Uh, there's three. So... Uh, let's see, no. Um, well, this is kind of all fucked up here. Um, that's kind of all messed up. So what if we just do this? Uh, yeah. Uh, I'd kind of like to keep that a hallway, I guess. Because then... Or not a hallway, but like open. So like we can have the windows out of the parole room. So maybe we just transform the yard here. Is that too big? Yeah, it is. Right? Yeah, it's this size. So we could fit a couple more in here. And that might be good. And then just have this open. And then maybe uh, this could be... Um, hmm. This was just a one narrow hallway. And then we just make this wall. Like, this is just wall that and then we can even get another one in here I mean it's gonna be tight I don't know does that just look shitty I don't even know what if we did another one like that that's a really small solitary cell but maybe that's okay because realistically if we end up getting small cells um, which is another 10 grand, but, or remote access has been approved, so that's good, but when we get another 10 grand, we can make these a lot smaller, like, I know these are dorms with two guys, but we can make them, we can make them a lot smaller, we can really start packing these dudes in here, I don't know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold off on that for now, and, um, we'll take a look at that stuff a little bit later, but, uh, I think for now it's okay. We do have two open, and you know Wallace is going to be in here almost permanently. I mean that guy's going to be max sec. Like he's, is he super max right now? Because he should be. He's in maximum security. He really should be in super max. Yeah, we're going to bump him up. I mean it doesn't really matter at this point, but there you go. I guess I don't really have. Supermax is just like normal. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. All right. Uh, where were we? What were we going to do? Don't really remember. Oh, we need to... Yeah, I want to get more of this stuff going. Look at all these license plates, man. We're just making cash. So maybe we need to expand. Maybe we need to start planning and get our... Um, our next wing up. 
So we can start getting the... Uh, we can work on the next grant, the sublock D, for 200 prisoners. And this, I think the next group is going to be the medium security guys. Uh, and we need to just plan out that wing and figure all that out. So let's, this will be a hallway continuing through here. That'll be good. Um, guess this is a hallway that continues down as well. And then this is going to be a hallway coming across here. So this could be a, just a giant cell block. And then they can share the classrooms. They can share the chapel with the min sec guys. But it's kind of nice to have that buffer. So, yeah, I think we do that. Well, I'm going to plan this out. And then I'm just going to hop right back in with you. So I will be back in just a flash. Okay, so we're back. This took... Uh, forever for me to do this, but planning is really important. So we, we had to figure it out. So basically this is going to be our new medium security wing. These are going to be showers up here. May not be enough. We may cut down. These are solitary cells. They're kind of just peppered around where we have them. It's not a whole lot, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then we have a couple here as well. Um, one, two, three, four. Four. We can actually do another one. Well, that's fine. So we'll do two down here, and then that'll be that'll be good. Um, might not be enough solitary. We can always. I feel like we're gonna be able to. Um, we can always figure that out afterward. But this is a lot. This is a good start. Um, and then down here, this is gonna be the canteen and kitchen for their own their own canteen and kitchen. And then this is gonna be I don't know maybe a cleaning cupboard or something where we can do laundry maybe not real sure and then a hallway uh i think they're all gonna have to share access to some of these things maybe maybe this should be a common room actually now that i'm thinking about it like a big common room uh yeah i don't know how many guys we're actually gonna get in here but we're gonna have to get rid of this fence so i think this is a good start let's demolish this fence all the way down here and let's get working on that. And then uh, we'll start putting in this foundation. We have 36 grand. I think we're going to be able to... We haven't had a single person pass the foundation education course yet. It kind of blows my mind, actually. Not a, not a single one. It's kind of nuts. we got to destroy this wall first, but I think that'll be a really good start. How many workmen do we have? Ten. They're going outside to do this. They're going through here. Uh, okay. Let's get uh, a couple more. Let's get 13. They can get working, get cracking on this. Um, and then we're also going to have to get these guys their own yard as well. Maybe we can just extend this yard out. I guess it could be a shared yard. Uh, we could just have them have yard time at different times and then just have them go down this hallway to it. That actually might be a a better uh thing let me just mark that down here so i remember but yeah we can just do like this sort of a deal and then just get rid of that and then this can be a whole big open hallway here it does connect them to minsec but then we'll you know we'll have a jail door here and all that stuff and we'll put a jail door here so they go out in different areas and i think that'll be okay all right so they're almost done with this i'm gonna want this wall expanded eventually we're gonna have to get perimeter wall and we are making a lot more money now, but perimeter wall is really fucking expensive. 200 uh, per square, which is crazy when you consider fence is three. Now, granted, I think the perimeter, they can't get under. Uh, I, I think they can't tunnel under the that stuff. You know what I might do? Fuck it. Let's just get rid of this down here. And let's get rid of this as well. I'm going to make this fence just go a, a larger area because we're going to be expanding. So let's just have it go out to how many is tiles? It's one, two, is it three to the edge? Yeah. Perfect. So one, two, three, four. So we'll go one more down. Let's just go all the way around. Let's just do it. How much is this going to cost me? 462 bucks. Very, very good. And then we'll just do this. Um, cancel. Damn it. 
It's stupid that it cancels the whole thing. But then we don't have to. Then we don't have to worry about dicking around with this stupid fence anymore. And then we can demolish all this as well. And I think that's gonna feel really good. I'm gonna feel really, really good about that. Very, very good. Cool. And that will uh, uh, be a lot easier. So, like, hopefully by that time we'll be able to find tunnels. What well, what I'll do is. Maybe we'll put a couple doors through here, and then we're just going to have guards. We're going to have dog patrols around this whole perimeter on the outside. Maybe two per um, area. Like, if we do a guard patrol here, that's two, two, so it's six. And then maybe a couple over here as well still, in case these guys tunnel out. But I don't want any of these clowns getting out, and especially once we start getting more guys who are going to be doing more tunneling. I don't want to deal with that. So, <clears throat> in fact, we're going to need to do a shakedown soon, probably. Um, but we will we'll figure that out when we get to it. Maybe we need to get some more prisoners in here. Let's, get our, let's look at our intake. What is our max capacity right now? It's 128. Let's bump it up. Let's just do it. Let's just bump it up to 128. Oh, shit. That's 21 guys in 15 hours we're getting here. But that will bring us to our capacity currently which i think will be really good um look at these guys hanging out in here working they're just standing around they're not even sorting any books do we not have any books no what is this is this the mail room deliver mail look at this this guy's working He's complaining about his bladder hogarty these guys are working in the laundry where's wallace but he's in solitary yep where else would he be? What are you in solitary for right now? He's in solitary for another 23 hours. For escape attempt, destruction, and attack staff. Yeah. Guy is... That guy needs his own wing. He needs permanent punishment. That's what we need to get from that guy. Well, actually, let me look at that right now. So we're getting tax relief. We'll get that in 23 hours. Uh, I'm going to do taser rollout. Because we're going to need that. And then I'm also going to do, well, 33 grand. We're making $7,400 per day in our cash flow, which is fantastic. Uh, so maybe we could afford to do it. We're also using these guys like slave labor, which is also good. Um... I don't know. Maybe we do. Look at this. We just got more money. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. Not here. Uh, taser rollout. Guard towers. We're gonna need to get, but we're also. I want to do permanent punishment. Let's get our lawyer doing something here. We'll get land expansion eventually. I think it costs eighty grand to buy the plot next to you. But there you go. All right. So let's, um, now that this fence is going out, is this still being taken care of? Yeah? These guys are just taking their sweet time. Well, they're building this one. Yeah, they're going to be busy for a little bit, I guess, doing that. So how's our one snitch doing? It's very alone in here. It's just Evans. Are there no lights? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why is that inactive? Oh, this guy's taking a break. I wonder if I need a couple more guards. Let's get a couple more guards in here. 33 guards. There we go. We can have some... Uh, everyone up and running. Is there... Are there lights in here? Man, I don't think there is. Well, let's get a couple lights in there. Because that's frustrating. Um, let's check our patrols while we're at it. So we got dog patrols. Yeah, we're going to have to change all these up. So, let's cancel those and those. Someone's got a shiv. Alright, so we have two dogs. How many armed patrols do we have? Or dog patrols? Four dog handlers. I'm going to get two more. And let's just set this up. Because why not? We're going to have dog patrols walking the perimeter of this entire of our castle here there and there's going to be one two dog patrols 
Then we're going to do one all the way up here. This may seem like overkill, but you know what? I don't think it is. No tunneling. Two there. And then one all the way along here as well. And then this is going to be one, two. So we need eight. Because we have one here and one along here. I guess we don't really need one here anymore. I'm going to get rid of that one. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of that one. Yeah, so two, four, six, seven dog patrols. Uh, we should have enough kennels. We do. But we only have six dog handlers. So seven, eight. Uh, and let's get a couple more in case they want to go and break. So we'll have nine. Nine dog handlers, and they're going to go out and do their, their thing. Doors. We're going to do staff doors. Uh, at these entrances and exits Maybe one there and then one all the way down here as well And uh, we'll Do the same Maybe we'll put one in the center here And one around here And we'll also do one like down here Great, I know it's keeping these guys really busy, but it's this is important. This is like basic infrastructure stuff that we're doing here another three grand for another prisoner it's awesome this is filthy in here this is disgusting do we have guys working in the cleaning cupboard or not foundation education eight passed wait a minute head of ten prison oh i see okay so eight guys have passed this we're at 80 percent we need two more guys to pass this and so now that means we can do the general education qualification. Three interested are qualified. All right, let's set up one time to do that. Where is this? Three to six. We don't need a. We don't need more than that because there's not enough guys to do this. Uh, and then hopefully we can get these guys to pass. Now there's only two interested and qualified. See, the thing is, like I was saying, is the guys who are gonna pass this course are probably gonna get let out first. That's the problem. Let's do, um, where does this take place? Led by a psychologist in an office. Uh, okay, maybe we need to do this. I mean, Wallace definitely needs behavioral therapy. These guys, this takes place in the, in, a, in the, uh, we can do carpentry apprenticeship already. Hell, fucking why not? Let's do it. Let's also do group therapy. And then, uh, excellent. So of alcoholics group therapy, we're going to do pharmacological treatment of drug addiction. And that takes place where? In an infirmary. Great. Behavioral therapy from 9 to 11. This is going to be great. These guys are all going to get reformed and it's going to be fabulous. I'm very happy for them. Alright, how are we doing on this stuff? How, it's really dark down here. What are you guys doing? It's got their little lights on. Looks like most of this is done. These guys are doing their job. Yeah, they're making their way. It's, uh... Yeah, it's heavy heavy lifting. Maybe we get a couple more staff. Like, maybe we get, like, 20 guys. Might be a little overkill, but... It might be worth it. Alright, let's get this brick uh, foundation up and running. How much is this going to cost me? It's going to be probably insane. Like, if I did this whole thing... 44 grand shit yeah that's nuts what if we just did here it's 26 already yeah uh we made it just get a little bit more cash i mean we're gonna get 7500 bucks in seven hours because we're gonna be getting 25 more minsec guys which would be good that'll give us a little bit of a boost i'm sure a couple more guys will get out it's it's one o'clock in the morning all these little babies are sleeping. We're going to get... More guys are going to go leave on parole soon. I guess we only have five prisoners up for parole, though. Interesting. Six in solitary. One awaiting. Mm, yeah, see, our solitaries are full. Solitary cells are full. Yeah, that's interesting. I guess we could do some salt. I mean, the shower doesn't need to be this big. Probably. Well... 
because most of them showers in there. I could reconvert this back to solitary cells. I could do that. And make it like, let's see. I could do this type of a thing. And then these are solitary. Like we could just do one buys of solitaries. Of course that doesn't fucking work. So we do this instead. Dogs sound like little monkeys. So we could do. Yeah. One, two, three, four. We could do eight solitary cells in here. Might not be a bad idea. We could still use this as the shower. Yeah, let's do it. We're going to need it. So let's just dismantle all this stuff in here. All this goes. I know I'm giving my workmen even more things to do, but um, that's the way it goes. This is going to be a jail door. I'm going to leave it open for now, though. I'm not going to do anything with that yet. And then I'm going to make sure that they strip down these walls as well. So it's going to take a little bit before they get to that. But it looks like this is coming up, though. Look at this. So we got fence all the way around here. This guy's really tired. I don't blame him. This is quite the project I gave them. Kind of out of nowhere, too. Oh, it looks like it's almost all done. Holy shit. Look at that. Nice job, workman. I feel a lot more safe now. This is all good. Look at that. They can go through these doors. Perfect. Is this all down? Yes, it is. That is... That is just fabulous. Good. So they'll get over here and they're going to start taking all this stuff out. And then we'll put a jail door here. Make this will be a wall. And um, these will all become solitary cells. I think that's going to be really good. And we can still have this yard. You know, it's kind of unorthodox. A little bit. But look at that. They're all going to work. Even the tired ones. Like, no breaks. They're just going right at it. I love it. I love it. Alright, so let's put a brick wall up there. And we'll do... Brick walls... All along here. I maybe should leave a, a gap there. I don't know. Or should I put a door? Or should I put a wall here as well? Hmm. You know what? Let's uh, dismantle this. Hopefully they... Oh, yeah, dismantle, dismantle both of those there. And then uh, I'll put a wall there. And then th this won't be like a... This can be a cut through here. I think that's going to be good. You take all this stuff to storage. We have so much shit sitting in storage. That's actually not that bad. We still have a lot of stuff in deliveries. Like all this sod. I don't fucking know why we have all this sod. I just really, really don't know. But, um, you know. There you go. Alright, so how are we doing here? These walls up yet? No. They're working on it. Good, good, good. Objects. Jail door. Right there. And let's make these solitary cells. So, to there. Perfect. Uh, solitary doors. Great. And we'll give them a toilet. And we'll give them a bed. Because they should be able to sleep. Because Wallace, for example, is going to be in solitary for very, very large periods of time. And so we want to make sure that uh, that's handled. Oh, some of this is going to be concrete tile. But I guess... Fuck it. That is what it is. It's fine. Alright, so let's get rid of that. 
and uh, I'm gonna put a wall in there at the at the last kind of thing we do here. Utilities, uh, of course they're not going right through them. That would only make too much sense. Look at these pipes. What a fucking mess. Oh well, uh, it comes with uh, changing things around, you know. It's okay, I think. We have a couple guys sitting in the holding cell. We have Chris Gear, who is, who might get on a parole actually, and then Arifyev. So what do they have? What is this thing? They have two. Um, all the cells are too high quality. Hmm. Well, but what a mess in here. This is just a mess. Alright, it's morning time. 45 minutes, we're going to get all those prisoners and get an influx of 7,500 bucks. Everyone's waiting for more parole. And that's really good. Yeah, these solitary cells are going to have nice concrete tile. So that'll be nice. Um, what is the problem? Oh, this is still a shower room? Oh, yeah. I gotta take that off. There we go. There we go. I was wondering why that was all getting all freaked out. Um, alright. It's almost done. Is it eat time? Why is everyone freaking out? Alright. Here comes the fresh meat. Coming in. Probably in a, in a few trucks, if I had to guess. Yeah. All right, we're going to get those guys in here, and then next time we're going to check through them to make, sur make sure none of them are snitches. But, um, everyone, I think that's going to do it for this episode. We got a bunch of stuff done. We have our new wing all, all set up here. We just need to do it. We got a better perimeter system of security. And we're getting some more solitary cells, and we're filling our capacity right now. So that's pretty exciting. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time in the Brick by Brick Correctional Facility. Bye, everyone.